In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to work from home worldwide with 11 companies that are almost always hiring entry-level remote jobs. So my team and I spent dozens of hours researching this, and there's actually 68 pages of research data. We wanted to find the absolute best companies and provide the best possible information for you. So if you appreciate that, go ahead, gently tap the like button, and let's jump into it with number one on the list, which is remote. Yeah, literally, this company is remote.com. And remote's global HR platform helps helps teams onboard talent from all over the world. This company has a lot of really well-known investors. They also have a ton of accolades. They also have some great perks and benefits, which I'll have pop up on the screen, including unlimited personal time off, flexible working hours, paid parental leave, and of course, health benefits and other insurances. But that's not all. They also have a learning budget, IT equipment, home office setup, social engagement budgets, co-working allowance, mental health support, and company options. So they offer some incredible benefits. Now, these are some of the jobs that they usually hire for. I'll have some current jobs pop up on the screen for you. And some of the salaries you'd expect to be paid for these types of jobs are going to be for junior QA engineer, about $21 to $72,000 a year, depending on where you live. For recruiters, $27 to $93,000 per year. And for inbound sales representatives, about $14 to $49,000 a year. So again, that depends on where you live. The lower amount would be for countries that have a lower cost of living. So yeah, definitely a very solid one. They also have a great name, remote.com. And there's a lot of work opportunities, both at the entry level and also at the mid level. Next on the list is going to be Omni Interactions. And this is a business process outsourcing company that provides customer support solutions across various industries, specializing in at home omni channel customer support staffing for services like sales and tech support. They also ensure high quality affordable solutions with a focus on security and innovative work life transformation. And they're also an extremely fast growing company, which means they're hiring a ton of people. Now, here are some job openings that they have right now. I'll put them up on the screen and some entry level work from home jobs they typically hire for are going to be customer service representative. They make about 14 to $20 per hour. And they also like to hire Spanish bilingual customer support representatives that make about the same. Here are some perks and benefits they offer. I'll put them up on the screen. And yeah, overall, a pretty solid option. Definitely one to look into if you're trying to get that first entry level remote job. Next on the list is going to be Thompson Reuters. And this is a Canadian multinational information conglomerate. Wow, that's a mouthful. Basically, the company was founded in Toronto, Canada, and it maintains its headquarters in that city's Bay Adelaide Center. Now they have some great perks and benefits. I'll have them pop up on the screen. You can pause and check that out if you'd like. And some entry level jobs they hire for are going to be safeguard telemarketer and customer training specialist. And for the telemarketer, they make around 39 to 60 $67,000 a year. And for customer training specialists, they make about $55 to $87,000 a year. Now, the telemarketer job is very similar to tech sales. And tech sales is a career I've talked about a lot on this channel. I've interviewed a ton of people that have been able to get into tech sales without a college degree or previous experience on this channel. I have an entire playlist dedicated to it. And they all use the company course careers. And you can check out a free tech sales training, which I'll put down in the description as well as the pinned comment below to see if tech sales is right for you and learn everything that you would want to know about it. Next on the list is going to be Solanus. Now, Solanus is a global leader in what's known as process mining, and they basically offer a data-driven and intelligent approach to optimizing business processes through their pioneering technology that automatically analyzes and identifies inefficiencies. Now, they hire all over the world. I mean, seriously, they're hiring in Japan, Spain, Germany, the United Kingdom, etc. And they currently have over 3,000 employees. Here are some of the perks and benefits that they offer. Here are some jobs that they're currently hiring for. And some of the salaries for some of the more entry level jobs are going to be $46 to $64,000 a year for payroll specialists, $77 to $124,000 a year for business development representatives, and $108 to $184,000 a year for back end engineers. So yeah, another really good one. And by the way, if you like any of these companies, just let me know, comment below which ones you like, and tell me why you like them as well. And I'll include more of that type of thing in future videos. Next one is going to be Parexel. And this is an American provider of biopharmaceutical services and is among the world's largest clinical research organizations. It conducts clinical trials on behalf of its pharmaceutical clients to expedite the drug approval process. This is another company that hires from all over. They have a lot of great perks and benefits. I'll have those pop up on the screen. And this company tends to hire people primarily for clinical research related roles, regulatory affair related roles, and network operations.
operations. For instance, data management leads make about $107,000 to $155,000 a year. Regulatory affairs associates make about $76,000 to $114,000 a year. And TMF specialists make $48,000 to $72,000 a year. So yeah, another really good one to look into. I'll put some job opportunities they have currently up on the screen. And next is going to be InTouch CX. And they're basically partners in growth and they help to scale and optimize their partner's CX or customer experience through a data-driven and brand-specific approach. And they basically do this by providing custom fit customer solutions. And here are some entry-level jobs they're hiring for. One position is customer service representative, which makes sense because they're all about customer experience and they pay about 11 to $17 per hour. So not the highest paying one on the list, but it's probably probably also one that's a little bit easier to get into than some of the other ones. So if you just want to get your foot in the door, get that first job, this could be a good option for you. By the way, if you're getting value from this and you think of somebody else out there who might also get value from it, maybe a friend, a family member, or someone who just needs to get a job, go ahead and share this video with them. Next on the list is going to be study.com. And this is actually a company that I have promoted myself in the past. I'm a big fan of them. And they're basically an online learning platform with engaging video lessons made by experts expert instructors. And in many cases, you can actually get college credits on study.com and then transfer them into colleges. This is why I've promoted them in the past, because you can literally save tens of thousands of dollars by getting your credits on study.com. Now, here are some jobs they're currently hiring for. I'll put them up on the screen. And they pay freelance writers, for instance, about $22 to $36 per hour. And they pay content editors $22 to $34 an hour. And yeah, I've made a ton of YouTube videos on them. They're a great partner. We've made a lot of money together. I've also saved a bunch of people a ton of money as well. I've also had many of my coaching clients promote study.com because I think they're such a great affiliate partner. And by the way, if you want to learn how to make money on YouTube, just like I do, I make over six figures a month on YouTube and I only have to work about four hours a week check out my coaching, right? I have a coaching program. I don't accept that many people because I can't work with that many people, but check it out. You can apply for it with the link down in the description below. Next is going to be the Healthy Back Institute. And this is a company that focuses on providing natural solutions and lasting relief from pain problems, particularly related to back pain, neck pain, and sciatica. They have really good perks, which I'll put up on the screen. And here are some of the current job openings that they have. And for positions like people operations generalists, they pay about 58 to 80 $88,000 a year. For value added sales reps, they pay $38,000 to $54,000 a year. And they have a general application just in case something's open. And they pay project managers about $77,000 to $129,000 a year. They also have a 4.0 star rating on Glassdoor, meaning their employees are very happy with the company. So yeah, another really good one to get into. I do like how they do the general resume application. So they basically just have you submit your resume and see if they have a spot open for you. And they're also growing very fast. So if if you made it this far in the video, that means you are someone who actually has the attention span to make it far into a video. So go ahead and hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell if you haven't done it already. And that way you won't miss my next video when it comes out. Next on the list is going to be Sutherland Global. And this is a company that specializes in business process transformation. And they're dedicated to redesigning and improving business processes for the digital era. And they leverage over 35 years of experience to provide advanced experiences to customers and employees of prominent brands. Now they have a lot of awards for being like a great place to work. They also have a ton of perks and benefits. Here are some of the entry level jobs that are available right now. And they pay about 40 to $56,000 a year for customer relations representatives. That is one of the entry level jobs. Some other jobs they hire for are customer care or tech support at about $18 an hour plus a monthly incentive of $275. And they hire insurance advisors at a competitive pay of about $20 per hour. So yeah, another really good one. Definitely one to check out lots of entry level opportunities here. Next on the list is going to be EXL Services. And this is basically a virtual partner for data-driven industries. And they use data, analytics, and digital expertise to transform businesses across sectors like insurance, banking, healthcare, and retail. And they've won a lot of awards. Here's one of the recent ones. Here's some of the benefits that they offer. It's pretty good. You know, they've got the healthcare, they've got additional benefits. Again, you can just pause it and check it out if you'd like. Here are some of the entry level jobs that they hire for. And insurance 
current specialists, for instance, make about 41 to $62,000 per year. So yeah, another good one to look into. Lots of entry level opportunities, also growing very quickly. Next on the list is going to be Bears Dev. And this is a leading nearshore technology solutions company that specializes in architecting and engineering scalable, high performing software solutions to meet the diverse business challenges of its clients. Here are some of the recent awards that they've been given. Here are some of the perks that they offer. Here's some jobs that they're currently hiring for. And in terms of pay for junior QA analysts, they pay about 59 to $96,000 a year. For junior Java developers, they pay 72 to $121,000 a year. And for email specialists, they pay 41 to $65,000 a year. There's also procurement analysts that make about 66 to $99,000 a year. Company has a 4.0 rating on Glassdoor, which is great. And I'm currently accepting about three to four coaching clients for growing on YouTube. So you can check out the link down in the description as well as the pinned comment below in order to apply. I've already got a ton of other people results, some people making over six figures per month as well. And some of them were other YouTubers that just wanted to grow. Some of them were brand new to YouTube and they were able to grow very quickly. And if you wanna check out 17 more work from home job companies that are always hiring, you can check that out by clicking right here.